integration uh, premium deluxe lace front wig and I have it in the style Toby and Toby is in a sun uh, C SP sunrise I'm sorry about that SP sunrise the wig on the model has on a rose pink so SP sunrise is absolutely gorgeous it does have a dark root 1b it does not go throughout the whole unit so you're not getting the 1b throughout the whole unit it's just in this perimeter of the unit you go into your burgundy and then you have a 613 and then you have a uh, oranges type color like really bright orange so this color is just gorgeous I really really do love it I did finger comb it out a little bit because it came as like straw curls and really stringy looking so I did brush it out you may have to do that as well if you don't like the way it looks um, yeah so if you don't like a very very uh, uniform and put together curl you might want to just finger comb it out to make it look natural or even brush it so as far as the texture on this unit it is a yucky texture it is not silky nor is it um, really you know real yucky is just in between the light yucky texture you do get a part on here starting here and ending here so you're getting about two and a half inches of parting there so not too bad at all i did take a little bit of my own natural hair out to disguise um the hairline the hairline is um it's okay on the sides but when you get right in the front it is a bit moon shaped so um you will have to take a little bit of your hair out especially if you're going to pull it up into like a ponytail or whatever um as far as shedding uh, i'm not really getting a lot of shedding um i have this you know i've had this wig on for about 20 to 30 minutes now and it's really not doing too much shedding but again if you're going to play with the unit it's going to shed on you so you just kind of want to leave your hands out and kind of you know um style it to your desire and then kind of leave it be so yes this is you know let me give you a 360 here's the front crisscross the latches so make sure you do this crisscross the latches over so that it can fit your head I just brought a little bit of the hair to the front you can leave some hair in the back um it is full it's not skimpy I think it's just full enough it's not too much hair and it's not too thin um yeah so it isn't shiny it doesn't have like a really shiny luster it is very natural looking so you can expect a very human hair looking unit uh, the cap is really comfortable it is like a mesh cap so um it's fitting very comfortably on my head um now you can curl this hair up to 400 degrees if you would like to um you can fluff this hair out you can let me show you if you don't want your hair kind of flat like mine is you can fluff it out a bit and um, just kind of make it come to life for you know you know whatever you want it to do for you and yeah just kind of pull the curls up you know out a bit and 
yeah you can make it how you want it I just kind of did my makeup to match the hair um, so yeah and if you care to know what palette I use I'll show you that palette at the end of this uh, review so yeah you do get a lot of colors with this unit and here is one on the front which is a rose pink I have done a review on this unit before in a TS toffee so I'll leave that link below you can click on and check that one out um so you do also get it in a blue silver which is cute i'm not that daring though i don't think that would look good on me but you cuties can try it out then we have the uh, ts toffee which i had and it's so cute rose gold right here and then you have the ts taffy which is pretty and then your pink gold which is also pretty um so yeah let me show you the box that it comes in um it comes in a very very long box which you can store your wig back in and you know keep it in a safe place and kind of just put it up in your room or your closet wherever you want to put it um so yeah if you like this wig make sure you give me a thumbs up um make sure you like comment and subscribe and let me go ahead and show you the palette excuse me i can't talk today y'all the palette that i use for this makeup look right here one second And this is a masquerade by Juvia's Place right here. And I love this palette. This is my first um, kind of expensive palette, even though it's not that expensive. Because I usually shop at the beauty supply store for my, um, you know, eyeshadows. So I use uh, this color here, um, this color, and also this color. And yeah, and I got this right here, this look here. So yeah, um, that'll be all for my review. I am thankful that you guys watch my channel. Again, I'm praying for you guys in Florida and all other states. And I love you guys. Bye-bye.